Hi, my name's Josh and Road Connect version 1.1 just got released the other day. And in this video, we're gonna be going into all the new updates, all the new features that it has, which I am I'm still quite in shock that this is free and then this update is free. So if you haven't downloaded it, you might wanna get on it now. And I, I wanna start by showing you probably my most favorite thing about this whole setup. You can record your podcasts absolutely anywhere. Yeah, mind blown. But this isn't the update we're talking about today. We're talking about the Road Connect version 1.1 and all the fantastic things it now comes with. And I have it right here open on the screen, which you can see now. And it's pretty familiar, except for this amazing little thing to the right here, which is the sound panel bar. And there's a couple other things we'll dive into, but I'm just gonna start with the obvious thing right here. And, and you're right, Josh, I know what you're saying. You're saying this right here is what you pay hundreds of dollars to get on the Rodecaster Pro. And you're correct, and they've just given it to us for free, which is insane to me. Um, and it's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's dive in. Exploring this panel, obviously you've got your fader here so you can adjust the volumes, but here's the really cool part. You've got some eight preloaded effects here. We've got the intro and outro. So if you were to start your show and you wanted to use this and you didn't have any other effects or anything ready to load in, you could just use this and you're good to go. And you can be like, welcome to my podcast. Let's dive in. You could do a professional fade out there and then we could just click to turn that off. That's awesome. You got some good things. If you make jokes and you got no one in the room or you want people to laugh at your jokes. You gotta laugh at, how good's that? That's awesome. And, and then you can really feed your ego with the applause button. Just thank you, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome for this video, you're welcome. Um, you've got the sad tombone, which is a bit like my life because there's no one in this room. Uh, you got the, the rim shot, so when you make a great joke. Um, and then you got the scary, so if you wanted to tell a really scary story, I guess you could you could lead in with this and with the right tones and sound effects, you could really wonder what came first, the chicken or the egg. And you've got crickets as well. Um, and then you've also got the harp, which is what we will share delightful thoughts with, the harp. Um, I think you'll be hearing a lot of the harp in future videos and some of these. Um, and another awesome thing is you have actually eight channels of inputs where you can just put in as many effects as you want, obviously up to eight, so not as many as you want, but you can reload them. And another thing you can do is if you right click one, you get this pop out window here, you can rename to whatever you want. You can change the colors so you can color code everything as how you see fit. Um, you also have a trash talk. So if you've got little swearers on your podcast, you can bleep them out. <laughs> That's a good time. We also have things like this. I've got it on toggle right now, which means you press it, it plays it through and it stops. You can also change to hold, which means you hold it down and it plays it as soon as you let go, it stops and it goes back to the start. Um, you can also change it to one shot, which means you hit it and it just plays through and then it'll stop. But if I hit it again, it restarts. So that means no matter what, you're gonna hear the full sound effect. So just keep that in mind because some things you might not want that. Um, whereas I'm gonna leave it on toggle because that gives you the control. You can hit it, you wanna cut it early and you just stop it there. Um, you also got things like replay um, or continued um, and you've got loop on, loop off. What I really love is you can load in your own songs or anything really, as long as it's a, a sound or MP3. So in here I've loaded some music, which I find cool because if I hit this, I've actually now got a backing track. So this is just saving me time in one editing. And two, if you make your own jingle for your podcast or whatever it is, you can load that in here. Um, you can demo songs, you can put music, uh, royalty free, obviously. You might wanna make sure it's not copyright. Um, this is Artlist, links in description. Get on it, people. Um, yeah, and you can just leave this so you can have your inspiration music playing behind you while you're talking. It is just awesome. I'm gonna leave this for the remainder of the video because I find it quite cool. But you know what, we will change it. Make sure loop is on which it is, and it's artless, so I know what it is. And we're gonna leave that on for the remainder of this little episode here explaining. So that is a really cool thing that all these effects do. Another thing you can do is before, if you wanted to hear a certain channel at all, you would have to um, mute everyone or slide their fader down so you could hear the channel that you wanted to hear. But now you can actually hit this little button here. So say I didn't want to hear the music, I can just select my own voice and in my headphones, it has actually muted everything else and it's just my audio coming through into my headphones. So I can be like, yep, my levels, yep, that's perfect. Continue on. 
It is a fun feature where you can just click on the ones you want to click on and it isolates it on, but the recording, as you can still hear, is still playing. So big, big ups to Rode for coming up with that one. I really like that one as well. Um, it's going to be really helpful. So if you're mixing it and you got your guests, you're not disrupting the flow of conversations. And and if, when you have those, we all have those doubts. Whether filming a video, you're like, is it in focus? Is the audio on? Is it good? I'm not sure. I need to check it. You hit that button and you're all good to go. So that's the new features in the version 1.1 for the Rode Connect, which is is a free download. So let me know in the comments if you're going to be downloading this. Let me know if you don't have a Rode NT-USB Mini now, if you're actually really strongly considering it, because I, I don't think there's anything else that really is on the same level as this mic and what it can do with this free software. And Rode has committed a roadmap already to new updates. So you just know the purchasing of this mic, you're investing into the future. So let me know in the comments and consider subscribing because we are doing a 1000 giveaway. Um, uh, yeah, that's right. You heard me right. It is now a giveaway. We have upgraded from every subscriber and future person. So if you watch a video in the future, and I've already hit it and it's released. Um, I'll be releasing something for free for absolutely everyone to download. But we are going neck level. So you definitely want to subscribe. Um, and in the next video, hopefully all the details will be released about that. Unless I haven't gotten quite to a thousand and that's a bit awkward, but we're literally like 20 people off. So help a brother out. Let's get there. And then I can give some stuff away. Uh, anyways, peace out guys. See you next time.